guys, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm gonna share with you a little Aldi's haul. And Aldi's opened up in my area just a couple days ago, and I'm so excited. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. And if you've already subscribed, welcome back. So let's get on with the video. I did a small little grocery shopping today. I wanna go and possibly do a bigger one, but I just got a few things today and I'll show you. Now I'll start with fruit. They had a huge selection of fruit and I got some blueberries and they're not organic, but this is a huge container and I believe it was like $2.99 and a traditional grocery store would be about $3.99. Then I got a mango and this was actually 79 cents and it looks really nice and juicy so I can't wait to eat this and I was gonna get some strawberries I was there yesterday just kind of perusing through the aisles and seeing what they had I didn't really have time to buy anything yesterday so I went back today but yesterday they were having a sale on strawberries for 99 cents so I was kind of bummed I missed out and they ran out of them but I guess they're still having the sale throughout the week. Today is only Monday, so I'm gonna go in tomorrow and snag me up some strawberries. So it was like a pint for 99 cents. So that is a great deal, I can't wait. And then I actually did forget to get some bananas too. And I think their bananas were like 49 cents or 44 cents a bundle. So that's a pretty good price. And then next I got yogurt. And I love yogurt, and they had actually a good selection. So the next time I go, I'll um, pick some more different varieties up. But I got some blueberry Greek yogurt this time, and these were only 69 cents, so you cannot beat that. Again, at like Target or a tr traditional grocery store, they would be like a dollar. So I'll be able to stock up and eat yogurt. A little bit more often then I got some vegetables and again their whole produce fruits and vegetables they had a huge selection so the next time I'll go I'm gonna pick up some more vegetables but I just got some things for my smoothies I got a bag of organic kale and I believe that this was $2.99 and Regularly, like at, again, Target or a different grocery store, they'd be $3.99. So I'm glad that I'm able to get my kale at a cheaper price. And then I got just some spinach. And I believe that this was actually $1.99. And the prices really remind me of Trader Joe's prices. And I think I heard somewhere or read somewhere that all these and Trader Joe's are kind of um, the same company a little bit, or they branched off. But anyway, I'm glad. So I got some good vegetables, and then I got a bag of carrots, but I forgot I put them away. So then I got two more items. I got creamy almond butter, and this jar was $4.99. When typically, again, at a different grocery store or at Target, they, this would really be like $7.99. So I am so glad that I can get my almond butter. And the only thing I don't like about it, there is added ingredients like sugar and salt. Um, but I guess that will be okay. I will see. And they also had cashew butter. And I might go read the ingredients of another almond butter maybe like at Target or something and see if they have the same I guess I've never really read the ingredients but anyway nevertheless I am glad that they have almond butter and then the last food item I got was these little mini quiches and this I believe was $3.99 or $2.99 but I'm excited about these and then I noticed that they really didn't have a lot of like frozen 
food choices. I mean, they had a lot of um, fish choices. I don't eat fish. And they had like chicken nuggets and egg rolls and things like that and Thai cuisine. They did not have many frozen food choices that I'm used to or maybe I just wasn't looking hard enough. So the next time I go, I'm gonna actually look and really focus on the frozen part and see what I find. They had a lot of ice cream, so I'll have to check those fun little ice creams out. And again, it kind of reminded me of Trader Joe's, just the different um, brand names and different varieties that you normally wouldn't find in a traditional grocery store. And then, last but not least, I'm glad that they carry this. I got some flowers. And this bundle of flowers, there's just some daisies and a few little roses and then some baby's breath. This was $3.99, I believe, or $2.99. But, so, I love having cut fresh flowers in my house. So that was an exciting find. So that will be fun to have fresh cut flowers every once in a while. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little Aldi's haul. If you have an Aldi's in your area, leave that in the comments, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.